This is it, ladies and gentlemen. TKRC Monster Trucks, the final bracket in our final racing class of the 2023 season. Pro Mod Bracket 2. We sort it all out right here as we get started by taking a look at qualifying highlights. Manic number three, Angels Bigfoot number two, and our points leader, Firestone Bigfoot with the fast qualifier position. Moving into round number one of racing, getting it started with Rotten Apple, the TLR version, and Bigfoot 13, the LMT. Possibly the last ride for Bigfoot 13 before it comes to be another truck in the blank stable, and I think that's the end of it. Stick a fork in it, it's done. Rotten Apple takes the measure of Bigfoot 13. On the line now, El Toro Loco, Chris Hackinson, and Indominus, Chris Parrish. A much shorter track than we saw in bracket number one, so a little less time to make up for mistakes, and Indominus looks solid moving on to round number two from the number 24 spot. Hellion, Iron, Aaron James, and Gravedigger, driven by Danny Borgers. Hellion takes the measure. Oh, a nice two-wheel save for Danny. We'll see him next year as he continues to get the setup on his new LMT truck. Rockstar, Isaac Ankrum, and we the people, John Wald. Pro Mod, our biggest class of this event with 24 trucks in the bracket. As Rockstar, the number 12, moves to round number two. <laughs> Troy Hawes, number 15, Mad Dog, and Ford Monster, John Wald, number 18. Oh! May have been a penalty. I didn't see if. John got up the face of that ramp, and yes, indeed, a nice victory for Ford Monster. USA 1, Keith Vogt on the line against Rotten Apple, the LMT version. Oh, wow. This is getting sloppy quickly out there. Someone's got to win. I'm not sure either of them wanted it, but the win will go to Rotten Apple. Someone must move on. Underpowered, Andy Salerno and Retrofoot, Keith Vogt. Oh, Retrofoot out wide around the turn, and Salerno with a nice smooth pass moves into round two. Our final pair in round number one, Laotian Commotion, Isaac Ankrum. Family from Laos and proud history there. Uh, so a neat identity for him to bring out against Awesome Kong. The final run for Awesome Kong and uh, not the way that Troy wanted to go out. Firestone Bigfoot, the number one qualifier with a tough draw facing off with Rotten Apple the TLR version on the line but immediately a different approach to the first turn for each driver and smooth and steady Firestone Bigfoot takes it the best of frenemies on the line here sudden impact Number three in points, facing off with number two in points, Indominus, Chris Parrish. Oh, Indominus a little out of shape on the straightaway and sudden impact puts the hammer down for the win. Right back up on the line, Taurus, Jeremy Mark, and Hellion, Aaron Janes.
Oh, Taurus in big trouble. Hellion sitting fourth in points right now, trying to gain ground on that podium. Looking smooth out there. The number five qualifier, Equalizer, and the number 12, Isaac Ankrum and Rockstar. Ankrum really known as a freestyler, but he will eat your lunch in racing if you don't watch him, but not this time. Equalizer moves on with a full blast over the race lane after the end of the finish line. Angel's Bigfoot facing off with John Wald Ford Monster. Bigfoot moves on. <laughs> Zeus, Iron Aaron Janes, and Doug Welker, Rotten Apple, and LMT. Oh, a little wide and slow around that corner for Rotten Apple means that Zeus rides the lightning and takes that victory moving on. Manic, Chris Hackinson, and underpowered Andy Salerno. Salerno a good run in round number one. This is the first time we're seeing Manic though. We'll see if that's an advantage. They're close coming to the finish line. Oh, and Manic all out of shape, underpowered, showing the power and soaring past him in the air at the finish line. Andy Salerno moving on. Salerno back on the line with big A's wrecking, facing off against Laos and Commotion. Will they be dancing in Laos? Not this time. It looks like Big A's is going to take that, but we're going to take a look at the TK replay just to make sure. Lotion Commotion with a penalty over that next to last obstacle, but Big A's all out of shape, but clean up the face of the ramp and over the finish line first. Neither with a pretty run, but Big A's getting it done. The final eight, round number three. Fast qualifier, Firestone, Bigfoot facing off with number eight, Sudden Impact. Oh, Sudden Impact hung up on the Jersey Barrier and it all unravels from there. Firestone moves to the semifinals. <laughs> number five, Equalizer, and number 13, Iron Aaron James and Hellion. Both trucks have looked good today. This should be neck and neck. Both trucks with the power down, flying down the finish straight away, and Equalizer takes the win. Angel's Bigfoot facing off with Zeus. Zeus out in the lead. Oh, Angel's Bigfoot in trouble as Zeus, looking good, moves to the semi-final round. Salerno with both troubles matching up in round number three. Underpowered will take that victory for a berth in the semi-finals. This should be a big matchup. Again, bitter rivals on the track. Firestone Bigfoot and equalizer Chris Parrish. Oh, it got wild on the top end of the track, but the win goes to Firestone Bigfoot. Zeus, Aaron Janes, underpowered, Andy Salerno. Despite a late charge by Zeus, underpowered, takes that victory, setting up his first berth in a final round at Trigger King RC, setting up the number one, Firestone Bigfoot, and number 14, underpowered, David versus Goliath, old versus new, and Solano's off to a big jump. 
Oh, but Firestone Bigfoot reels him back in and catches the win at the finish line. A great corner by Chandler in the Bigfoot truck with the power down in the final straightaway. And that's all she wrote as our points leader wraps up a bracket victory. Also making him the overall event winner for the day, Firestone Bigfoot, which will also make him the overall season champion. But more points results coming in a video here soon. We'll go through it all. Should be exciting to see the final points tally. A lot of shuffling in the top seven through this final day of action. As always, we thank you for joining us. We thank all of our sponsors that make it happen every year. Everybody that puts all the hard work in and everyone that comes out to the events. Thanks for joining us. 